Namika here. So this is the second part of the video where I troubleshoot a reported issue by the client and also from their member. So the client has reported that their member said that after they purchase a new course, it's not tagged. So it was not, they did not receive the access. Now in our end, we know that the tag was not triggered properly. Now this is a setup with Body Boss and WP Fusion and it is a tag based access with LearnDash. So in this um, report, what I've done first is I did some tests with DriveCart and you will see how I did that. So turning on the test mode of your DriveCart, you need to do that and you should be able to test it without a credit card requirement. And also you're gonna figure out what was the reason why the first access, because it was a two course report that they said that the access was not generated and they needed to manually apply the tag so the first one it was more it was because there was no automation set so maybe you miss that in your process so i'm gonna show you how i troubleshoot that and fix that and the next one was it just needed like few seconds for the tag to be applied in sync so you need to like tell your members or let them know that wait for a few seconds before their access gets updated but they don't need to log out and log in again because that was the first scenario that they have when they were not using like WP Fusion and we have already fixed that by synchronizing or running the webhook and um, tag update when the contact records get updated as well when the tag is applied or remove as well so yeah let's check out this video and if you have any question regarding this process please comment it down below and i'll check that when i can so thank you and let's proceed to the video This one, I did check, um, so example, this is the contact logs for that. And if I check this in Thrivecart, so that was 21, the transactions, email, all time. So it was, can't find. Twenty one exploration and twenty two. So three zero seven three twenty eight PM UTC. If we check here, so we have the twenty one and twenty two. This is so. So if that was 3.28 p.m. So 3.28.15 in military time. Was that the time that you... 17. Auto-enrolled. Okay, so this was the first one. And then, recent activity, user profile. Hmm. Let me try to do a test purchase right now. So let's search for 21. I'm just gonna edit this. And then just putting it to test mode temporarily. Okay, and then I'm gonna log in. So I am now log in and I'm gonna do a test purchase. Okay, copy card. 
So in my courses, I don't have access to that, not enrolled. And I'm going to try to complete my order. So thanks for the purchase. Refresh. So no course in here. And then if I look at my logs. So no course in here. Okay. We do have a webhook assigned for that one. This one contact tag added and removed. Update tags. I look at my contact here. So we now have okay. Hmm. And that's automation. So these are the tags. Uh, hold on. I didn't have Hmm. Seems like it's not attached to the product. There's no tag applied to my contact after the purchase of the 21. Okay, so there is no tag applied to me regarding the 21 course purchase that I did. So when I check in DriveCart, there is no behavior that add them in that automation. I think, let me check if Jay has an automation for the 21 course. So we did not set up this automation and we are only helping linking it to WP Fusion purchase, I guess this one, purchase. Okay, this is the automation that um, put them into that access. So what we need to do is, so in the behavior, it's only giving this spreadsheet. So what I can do is we need to add them an active campaign automation. So purchase. Of that one. See. So that's the main reason. And if I track, let me just put this to live. If I track the 22. I think it's this one, behavior, added to active campaign, twenty two MKE. Okay, this one has that automation. So let me try to test purchase this since it has that automation ready. Copy. Okay, so I'm gonna decline that offer. And proceed. 
So if I refresh here, so no tag, no new tag applied. I mean, no new course opened. If I check here, twenty-two. Okay, let me check. Okay, so well, I I just refreshed it. Hmm. Okay, so I simply refresh the page. Haven't edited something. So I think it just needed that time. Because if the automation works in active campaign, is it will load and push that. So it just needed more time. So far with this 22, I didn't have any issue. Even in WP Fusion Log, the enrollment was successful. So as long as the drive cart is attached to the correct automation, it should work. So again, I'm going to put this to live again. So yeah, let me know if this helps. It's a bit long video, but I want to show you that what's working and how it works from my end and where I am looking at that data. So if you need or have any other question, let me know and I'll take a look at that.